Hello, this is Chuck Collins. He's the author of the book, 99 to 1, How Wealth Inequality is Wrecking the World and What We Can Do About It. Chuck says that in the past few decades, wealth and income inequality has gotten ridiculous. We're now living in a period of extreme inequality. This inequality affects everything we care about. It's undermining public health and happiness for everyone, including the wealthy. It's breaking our communities apart, leading to crime and fear. It's undermining our democratic system, stealing our votes as the 1% dominates politics. It's killing the chance for our young people to get ahead. And it's bad for business, at least real, honest, job-creating business. As Chuck says, too much Wall Street hurts Main Street. Inequality is undermining our way of life. And unfortunately, it's a problem that will not go away on its own. You might ask, how did inequality get so bad? Well, it's the inequality death spiral. As wealth gathers in the hands of the 1%, the 1% uses some of that money to pay lobbyists in Wall Street, manipulate government, and rig the rules. This leads to a decline in quality of life for the 99%, and it happens again and again, a vicious cycle. Rules such as trade policy, taxes, government spending priorities, regulation, rules governing corporations, the financing of elections. These rules have benefited the 1% at the expense of the 99%. So who are the 1%? Well, they aren't all bad. There are many wealthy people who care deeply about fairness and opportunity for all. Many work through networks, such as Wealth for the Common Good and the Patriotic Millionaires. But some in the 1% use their wealth and power to rig the rules. These are the one percenters we're talking about. But we can reverse these inequalities. In September 2011, a group of protesters started the rallying cry, we are the 99%. 99 to 1 is a powerful lens for understanding the inequality that has grown in the last 30 years and what we can do about it. We can lift the floor by raising the minimum wage and ensuring health care and education for all. We can level the playing field, eliminating rules that work for the 1% over the 99%. We can ensure wealthy Americans pay their fair share by raising taxes on the wealthy, closing tax loopholes and subsidies, reining in CEO pay, and breaking up big financial institutions. Chuck talks about this more in the book, as well as how to build a movement to get us there, some of the hopeful actions that readers can participate in. He believes that we are waking up as a country and as a planet. There's a growing recognition that inequality matters. We want an economy that works for the 100%, not just the 1%, and politicians who work on policies that strengthen the 100%, not just the 1%. So, we need to get organized. We need to get together with our families, friends, and neighbors in small groups, affinity groups and resilience circles, and take action together. We need to join with emerging campaigns and movements to create a better economy and reverse inequality. And with you and others getting engaged, we can build an economy that works for everyone. Thanks, and please look for the book at www.99to1book.org.